or even people that you do watch that do do that do do that do 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 that do do daily vlogging is exhausting but is it really worth for your channel to be vlogging daily? Hello and welcome to this video. It feels like forever I haven't done one of these sit in front of the camera to talk about a topic. But today's topic is about daily vlogging. So for the past week, I've been vlogging daily in a trend that's called Vlogmas, where big YouTubers usually vlog the day in their lives for 24 to 25 days leading into Christmas for December. And this is because of the whole Christmas vibe. It gets more views, it gets more attention. People on the internet in December are more likely to be watching Christmas content. And it was only on December 1st when I woke up and I saw this trend and I was like that is great my channel will grow if I do it every single day however here is a few things that you definitely need to know before you start vlogging every single day so vlogging daily is exhausting as you can imagine doing day in the lives every single day is so exhausting you have to carry your camera around everywhere you have to always have content because not everyone's daily life is going to be vlog worthy or you might not think your life is vlog worthy it kind of gives this additional pressure to do certain things that you wouldn't usually do to make it more content friendly if, for people who are new to the channel something that they will look up to something that will enjoy for christmas so it gives you that additional pressure on top of everything that you're currently doing such as doing a phd meeting friends and stuff like on top of that you have to take a camera some people do not like to be on camera so then you can't really include that footage in the video and then of course at the end of the day you have to edit it and publish it on the same day so that's incredibly time consuming although editing is one of my favorite times of the day i really do love compiling all the clips that i've taken throughout the day and then putting onto a timeline adding music and doing my own cuts and edit i really enjoy it however it's the process leading up to it which is very very stressful in getting the right content filming the right scenes getting the lighting correct it's just making sure the microphone is on is another big one <laughs> also you might be able to tell from my face it's only been six days i've only vlogged six days vlogmas day six and i'm exhausted it's just another level of not being able to switch off and that's a big consideration that you need to make before even thinking about daily vlogs or even people that you do watch do do daily vlog you have to commend to the amount of effort they put into it even if that's their daily job like they're not really living life so when you're vlogging you're not really living all the moments because of course you have to worry about the camera being on, you have to worry about the microphone being on you have to worry about capturing it all so you're not living in the complete moment which can be which can be not the best thing however as you vlog more you, you just become used to it and you kind of can live in the moment more than you think so but one thing about vlogging is that it can take away from the moment so is it really worth doing daily vlogs well my personal opinion is probably not just because of the effort that's required but also if you think about it unless you're a complete vlogger a person who is known for doing daily vlog you're going to be messing up your whole feed with day in the life or themed content such as vlogmas and it's not really enticing new subscribers if they came in for your vlog content that is not really representative of your normal channel like for example i feel like my content for vlogmas is a little bit more representative of my channel because it's a phd vlogmas but also in the same vein i feel like it's not exactly my channel because i am more of a channel that gives phd advice life advice but also like vlogs to do with phd but forcing vlogs day in and day out i think that could be detrimental to the channel the other reason why i say it might not be worth it is because your growth will be very slow so unless you do 25 videos in a row and you actually get through that which is very very difficult you're not going to see any growth until probably day 20 so like like with any exponential incremental increase the beginning takes forever and you will not see any results and that can be very very demotivating especially when you put all your time and effort and you sacrifice all your rest and your social life for making vlog contents and not seeing the immediate reward so it can be very difficult however i feel like this is a very very big challenge for me and the reason why i wanted to do it is because of how challenging it is and I always preach about consistency on YouTube and this challenge just reinforces the fact that consistency is very very important so if I'm gonna make it through to day 25 on vlogmas then I'm gonna have to be consistent and it just gives you the skills if you can do this you can do a lot of things you just have to believe in yourself I am not entirely sure if I'm gonna complete the whole way through like today I felt very very demotivated in producing these daily content and it's not the reason why you probably think it is it's because of my channel health I feel like 
doing Christmas themed throughout that many days might affect my channel because I'm not really a Christmas channel nor do I do many many Christmas jolly festive stuff so just from today I'm rebranding these videos these vlogs just to be normal vlogs I don't actually mind daily uploads daily vlogs is actually very interesting to me so I think I'll continue for now with the daily vlogs but not toward the whole theming thing so then you have to be careful about your theming so yes I just wanted to get this off my chest because I've just been making vlogs and vlogs but I do love these kind of videos and I want to say that if you are not just a vlog channel then maybe just vlogs can affect your feed for that reason I'm going to put this video out and hopefully some other videos within the vlogs so people that have subscribed may have subscribed for the other content even though they might want to know my day in the lives and my day in the lives do the best they will still want the normal content so for that reason I am going to be posting I am going to be posting normal content too so if you do want to check out my daily vlogs make sure you click the link up there I'll make sure I put the playlist up there if you like this video you know what to do subscribe if you want to see more contents like this and if you have a youtube channel and you want to know more about vlogging i hope this video has helped a little bit i love filming these kind of videos and you definitely will see more so as always thank you for watching